Okay, so what do you guys think for a theme this year? More silly? I feel like she's more like edgy Christmas. Okay. Yeah, that's me, edgy, edgy Christmas. Christmas. <laughs> Every year we try to have a theme and a very important element to any time I give a party of any kind is a party favor. I happen to love, love, love this candle. This is like my favorite thing. It's so cool. It smells so good, you guys. Oh, wow. Isn't that gorgeous? Isn't that gorgeous? And there's always something that we're working on during the year. This year I wrote a cookbook about all the things that I have been cooking for my family since Courtney was born basically. So that's going to be a party favor. Do you think well, you let's, with the sushi no, no, no. Yeah, yeah, I want the right. traditional, like, Christmas, right. Thanksgiving turkey. dinner, turkey, yeah. stuffing, your, gravy, your sweet potato, sweet potato, 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 potato souffle potato. that I'll yeah. make. I love to do the desserts, so I want to pass that down to my kids and have them incorporate that into their family and their traditions when I'm long gone. Hi. Oh my god. We brought god. you some gifts. Some These are gifts. incredible. Jeff Latham is truly one of the most creative people I have ever met in my life. So he, when I started thinking about Christmas, he was my first call. So typically what goes on is that table goes away. Okay. And then that's kind of the... 15 foot Christmas tree that's the so center it almost of the goes house. To the ceiling. Yeah. And then yeah. do you put gifts under the tree as a touch before? I do. I, okay. We always have gifts under the tree. I would love it if when we come up with our theme, you help me with the with wrapping the paper. Wrap. Okay. Because I love for it all Perfect, to, to be match. so seamless and You're beautiful. Just like me. <laughs> well, let's Wait, walk so around. You show okay. me some of your other. So that. Okay. But I thought what we could do is garland up Perfect. there and then make the kitchen really Christmassy because this is kind of like we're all, I love to bake at Christmas okay. time, so this is, it needs to smell like gingerbread. Yeah, and to do. So this is the bar. Okay. And it's definitely the hangout for the holidays. Okay. So what we do is a tree goes right in front of that mirror. Okay. And we decorate it really cute, more like Different for than kids. Different the entrance. Yeah. Okay. And then I also want you to talk to the girls about doing something at their house. Perfect. Yeah, because they're gonna- Chloe bought a house this year, and Courtney bought a house this year, and Kendall bought a house this year, and Kim bought a new house this year. I do feel a little bit like it's an empty nest. Kylie and I are the last ones that are gonna be here, so, and she keeps telling me and reminding me daily that she's 17, and there's only, you know, a few months left, you know, till she's 18, and so I ignore her, because that's gonna be weird and hard, but, one day, I know that I'll look around and they'll all be gone. And it's like so fast, you know, it happens. Don't get emotional. Yep, not gonna do it, not gonna do it, not gonna do it. Is this the book? That's the book. So you guys have been working on this. This is amazing. I love it. <laughs> Christmas Eve is one of my family's biggest nights of the year. We look forward to it all year long, and it's magical. Well, I've never taken any music lessons, so I don't really know amazing. exactly what I'm doing. Really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Everybody's been so nice here. We're just, it, it just came out like we're having so much fun, so it came out. Happy, I hope. Oh, great. <laughs>